I am role-playingly skinny and today on Three Minutes Gone I want to talk to you about Dungeons and Dragons. That's three minutes gone. Now throughout the 80s I was a big Dungeons and Dragons player. I uh, really uh, enjoyed uh, getting together with groups of friends. We This was like pre-tablets, pre Pre cell phones, pre you know that that online video game era, and so it was getting together with friends, uh, hanging out for an afternoon of imagination and going on quests and uh, discovering new areas. It was uh, it was a really fun thing to get together with buddies in the flesh without any screens. Now in 1982, a very unfortunate uh, a set of events unfolded where there was a young man, uh, Irving Lee Pulling. Um, he was a uh, he played Dungeons and Dragons, but the the kid also had some mental health issues that he uh, struggled with, um, and he took his own life. Now from there, the poor kid's mom uh, kickstarted a media campaign to talk about uh, Dungeons and Dragons as a gateway to evil. Now I've played it hundreds of hours, and I've never seen anything like that. Uh, the storyteller or dungeon master, uh, it's uh, their job to create this kind of uh, fantastic uh, fantasy world. Uh, it reminds me a lot of the Chronicles of Narnia. <laughs> Now Narnia is this fantastical world uh, where there's uh, magic and, and speaking animals and there's a, a witch and fighting a lion and uh, there's uh, all sorts of uh, interplay in, this, in this, this allegory and good versus evil. The unfolding of the storyline could be like an exact campaign in D&D. Have you forgotten the laws upon which Narnia was built? Do not cite the deep magic to me, witch. Was there when it was written. Now, if my kid said, "Hey, uh, we want to get together with some friends and play the Chronicles of Narnia game, and it's this, you know, uh, magical land of, of, of and we're gonna, you know, cre create these environments and use our imagination," and it's gonna be a one. <laughs> And there is battles and spells and very Lord of the Ringsy. I would think that that is a fun afternoon. Uh, no screens, getting together with people, enjoying the camaraderie. Uh, all of those things I think are fantastic. As a parent, I empathize with uh, this woman and her loss of her son, and what a tragic set of circumstances. Uh, I think it's just a bummer that D&D got the shaft on this whole thing, because uh, my experiences with it are that it's pretty good. I'd love to hear in the comments uh, what you think of, of it, if you've played it, or if you think I'm off my nut on this one. Uh, so uh, please, yeah, let me know. I am skinny, that is a couple seconds on D&D, and three minutes gone. Last three minutes gone. Mumbler!